And welcome back to Stockholm. Thank you very much. How does it feel to be back after your mission? Uh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy to be back and uh, I feel um, this, you know, this feeling nostalgia yeah. that we have now because uh, oh, almost three months uh, passed uh, from the Eurovision yeah. and I'm here again and I'm happy that I, I'm going to perform tonight again here in Sweden, uh, in Stockholm, uh, during the Pride, uh, so I, had, I will have a chance um, and an opportunity to say thank you, my dear audience uh, here in Sweden. Um, for support that I, I received from them, yeah. uh, the Eurovision, so uh, I will perform tonight uh, with the best fitting. Yeah, and I saw on your Instagram that um, you're going to perform Breaking Away. Well, I, I'm going to perform two songs. Uh, two songs. Yes, I'm going to perform my new single called Breaking Away, and of course, you are the only one. Uh, <laughs> of course, yes, because, uh, that's tradition. That's tradition, <laughs> and I hope that the audience will recognize the song and they will sing without me, or with me. <laughs> I think everybody will sing along. Well, I, I would love to, to hear the, the audience uh, sing it very loud, so I hope so. And I also saw on your Instagram you posted a picture and you said that Stockholm gives you luck. Yes. Can you describe what do you mean? Well, first of all, uh, the Eurovision. I, I think that I, and I, and that I had uh, lots of luck from uh, the city, from the citizens, from the audience and the global arena. Uh, and uh, they supported me during my performances uh, at the Eurovision. Also, uh, I recorded uh, before Eurovision, I've been uh, in Stockholm. Home and uh, uh, I recorded uh, about seven songs here. Oh. Yeah, so uh, and they became very big hits in Russia. Uh, so that's why. Yeah. And I'm here again. That's amazing. And how has the time been after the mission? Because I've seen you've been traveling all around. Yes. Yeah. Yes, I, I, I traveled a lot and uh, I visited a uh, few countries that um, uh, I had the performances there, the shows in, in uh, Greece and uh, Azerbaijan and Moldova and Belarus. Um, and I'm here, I'm gonna go to Lithuania. Uh, also, uh, we're trying to book more um, shows uh, in Europe, but uh, uh, after I came back to Moscow, to Russia, uh, after Eurovision, I went to uh, my big tour, uh, and I'm on tour also now, <laughs> just a uh, few days off from my tour for this uh, event, for a Pride mm -hmm. here in Stockholm, but when I come back in Moscow, I will go again. Uh, to Russian cities because I, I fully booked to the, uh, the end of the year. Oh, you're a busy, yes. busy man. Yes, and I have uh, I didn't have actually didn't have um, uh, holidays at the Eurovision yet. Oh, you haven't? Yeah, I didn't have. Uh, work uh, holiday. Yes, and I'm I'm gonna have it in the in the evening in the end of at the end of August. I will. You gotta take some break. Off. Some break. Yes, I, I have to. I have to because I have a very uh, very busy. Uh, autumn, I have a big show in Moscow. Uh, we're gonna ce celebrate uh, the um, uh, how it's called hundred. Uh, the, the, the show in Moscow will be the, will be the hundred show of uh, my tour. Yeah. So uh, it's gonna be so huge. Be like big. Yeah, yeah, very big. So I have a lot of plans, and yeah. also re recording my new uh, uh, songs. Are you making a new album? Uh, well, it's now it's song, like song by song, you know, and they will it will be the album at the end, but yeah. now it's it's uh, step by step. Do you know when it will be released? Uh, next year. Next year. Yes, yeah, so next year. But but uh, here uh, and, um, we will release Breaking Away uh, this autumn. So it's a new single that I'm, I'm, I'm promoting it now. It's it be out in Russia, but it's gonna be a bit more uh, released here a little, a little bit later. Um, so we're gonna do a few more songs. Yeah, because you released song like in 2015, Breaking Away, and you're doing the video now. Yes. How come? Well, uh, we uh, we decided to uh, like to keep this uh, uh, video for future, and uh, we we tried to find the right like 
time for this for, for this video because the videos were, I think were great and uh, very romantic and uh, dyna dynamic also uh, and the song is really great uh, but I uh, I didn't release it because uh, in in Russia I had another song that. I, re I released uh, and we, we, we didn't want to like mix everything together uh, to confuse my, my fans, my viewers. So uh, now it's a perfect time for this video, for this song, because also this song was written by some writers of uh, You Are The Only One, the same team. Oh, yeah. So it's a connection and they from Greece and the girl from the video show, she's a Greek actress, a uh, famous uh, Greek actress. Um, so I think it's absolutely perfect time for this video. Yeah, that's and tonight you're gonna to perform at Pride Park yes. for the Shorter Night as well. Mm -hmm. And there is also gonna be Beret from Spain mm -hmm. and the star from Israel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you met anyone else? Not, not, not yet, not yet. Uh, but we go, we're gonna see each other tonight yeah. for sure. I'm, 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 I really wanna uh, meet them again because I, well, I have so many great uh, memories and emotions from the Eurovision and I miss this atmosphere, I miss uh, my friends from uh, Eurovision and other competitors so I'm happy that I'm gonna meet each other again. You almost said like a family to Eurovision. Yes, yes, of course. We are, we're, we're forever in the history of Eurovision in 2016. What do you miss most about Eurovision and this whole circus? Well, I don't know, the whole thing. Uh, yes, because the performances uh, there at the Global Arena, the, the, the audience, uh, the nerves that we had, like the stress that we had, and all the uh, attention that we had, and, uh, and the atmosphere. It's really hard to explain and really hard to describe something and, and uh, to choose some, something, uh, just one. It's in, in the package, you know, the whole thing. And I'm really happy, and I'm really happy that I had this performance in my life, this experience, performance in my life, uh, one of the best experiences in my life. And um, I'm, I'm, I have no regrets about uh, doing it. But has your life changed a lot after your vision compared to before? Well, back home in Russia, for example. Well, uh, it's not like it's completely different. No, uh, because I was a famous uh, artist in uh, Russia and I had big experience uh, even without Eurovision. But uh, of course, Eurovision uh, gave me so much. Like for an artist, yeah. for a person, for a professional, um, and of course I received a lot of support from uh, Russian people uh, because they they were so nervous and they were they, they, the ratings are was so was so high in, in Russia and uh, yeah, very high expectations, expectations yeah. also. But you know, uh, of course uh, everybody was upset that we didn't uh, win. Uh, but again, everybody was so happy that we won a telegram to the end. They, 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 <laughs> they, they called me like a true winner, the real winner. The, yeah. But of course, the, every, 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 every country, um, when they send uh, somebody to represent the uh, country, of course they wish them the be all, all the best luck uh, for, for your own country, you'll all, will always be the winner. Yeah. So, uh, but I'm happy that uh, I did my best in the, the, the final, the final night, and I'm so happy and I'm proud of myself, of my country, and my team. Uh, we really did a great job, and we missed this whole thing very much. Thank you so much. Thank so, you. Thank and, you. Uh, I'm happy to see you tonight. Yes, I, I'm. I'm
Perhaps I'll see you tonight, and uh, maybe sometimes you will come to Moscow, Russia, and we'll don't, be, don't be afraid. Uh, we'll. <laughs> yes, because it's it's amazing city, it's amazing uh, country, and you have to visit it for sure. Uh, maybe on November 24th, when it's uh, done, uh, it will be the Moscow show. Uh, it's gonna be because I have a lot. I know that a lot of people, uh, European people, uh, who um, like recognize me from the Eurovision, they will come to Moscow. To Russia for my show, special oh. for my show. Yes, the foreign foreign fans. Uh, we have to make sure to get there. Huh? We have to make sure to get there. Yes, you have to. Be, you have to be there, uh, and uh, for sure we're gonna make everything. Uh, but if you decided, please tell me. Yeah. So I invite invite you to to visit my show. Uh, in Moscow. is going to Moscow. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.